Hey guys, Tasha here from Stardust Gold Crochet. This week's Saturday Stitch Explorer tutorial will be coral mesh. And this mesh is something I came up with um, because I'm making a top and I just wanted to do something beachy for summertime. So grab your hook and your yarn. I'm using a five millimeter, five millimeter hook there and I love this cotton. To start this stitch, we're going to create a slip knot and then we're going to chain any multiple of five plus two at the end. So I'm gonna do 25 for this tutorial. So there's five, 10, actually I think I'll do 15. That'll make it easier. So there's 15 and then I'm gonna add two so the first stitch we're going to do is we're going to work in the second chain from the hook and we're going to do a single crochet into that chain. And then this incorporates a Solomon's knot into it. So if you're not familiar with a Solomon's knot, it's very easy, but it does take a little getting used to. So you have your single crochet there. You're going to just pull up that loop and make it a long loop, yarn over, pull it through and then we're going to chain one. There's your, your Solomon's knot. So next we're going to skip one, two, three, four, and in the fifth we're going to do a half double crochet. So yarn over, insert your hook, grab a piece of yarn, grab your yarn. I kind of bunch these up together, it just makes it easier. Yarn over and pull through all three and there's your half double crochet. So this stitch and this mesh is super easy. We're just going to be doing Solomon knots and skipping four. So we've got one, two, three, and four. And in the fifth, you work a half double crochet. And so we're going to work one more and just pull up the Solomon's knot, yarn over, pull through, chain one. Then we're going to skip one, two, three, and four, and work a half double crochet into the very last stitch. So for row two, it's pretty simple. I'm going to get a little bit closer for row two. There we go. So we're going to chain one. And here you can chain two if you'd like. It's up to you. Um, it'll make a little bit looser on the ends. Mine is kind of tight, but I like it that way. So then we're going to turn and we're going to work a half double crochet into the very first half double crochet that we worked. And then we're going to repeat and do our Solomon's knot. So pull up, pull through, chain one. Then we're going to skip on over to the half double crochet and work into that half double crochet another half double crochet. and we keep doing that, that's our repeat pattern. So we repeat row two until we reach our desired height. So just pull up, keep working your Solomon knots and work into the half double crochets like that. I kind of twist them around because working with meshy um, is kind of difficult to do half double crochets. And then we're gonna go ahead and work into that very last half double crochet of the row. Do they get a little bit twisted like that? So I just kind of push it back a little bit and pinch it so you can grab and get all three of your loops on your hook. There we go. And that's it, you guys. It's a super simple stitch and I really love it. It creates a nice mesh, it'd be great. I'm doing a um, top in this right now. So keep an eye out for that. And um, I'll put the link in the link down below in this description when I actually get it finished. <laughs> Okay, you guys, subscribe, hit the little bell, and I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Happy crocheting, and always if you have a stitch you want me to make for you, I'm happy to do that. Or um, if you just want to talk about crochet, hit me up on my blog or on my Facebook page. I have a group there on Facebook, too. I'd love to see you guys there. Take care. Happy crocheting.